Oh my God. Was Davis holding Jimmy in the basement? They're lucky to be alive. Jimmy, I'm so sorry. Whatever you do, Chloe, just stay away from that monster. You know, Chloe, I thought about calling the police. Instead, I figured I'd give you a chance to explain yourself before I let them haul you off to prison for harboring a serial killer. I shouldn't have left Davis here alone. This would never have happened if I was here. This is all my fault. Would you become one of the bad guys, huh? For whatever reason, I calmed the beast inside him. He needed me. He needed you. So the needs of the cornfield killer outweigh the needs of the rest of the world, is that it? Oliver, it's complicated. No, it's complicated. Yeah, that's the same thing your psychopathic boyfriend told me. Look, either I keep him with me or let innocent people die. Come on. Chloe, if you really believe that, you would have handled things a little bit differently, don't you think? Instead, what do you do? You cook him dinner, you fluff his pillow, you rock him to sleep. Okay, look, I understand what it looked like from the outside, but trust me, I had the whole thing under control. Chloe, you didn't have anything under control. Speaking as Davis's next victim, I can tell you, your plan was seriously flawed. How did you think this was gonna end, Chloe? I'll find him, okay? I'll fix this. No. You won't. I think you've done enough. We'll let Clark handle it from here. Wait, Oliver. Where is Clark? Oh, he took Davis. He's finally gonna finish this.